So the first inaccuracy is that the fact Spinosaurus is classed as a tank, and T-Rex and Maposaurus are classed as an attacker. In real life, it will be the other way around. Both T-Rex and Maposaurus would be tanks, while Spinosaurus would be an attacker. In this game, Carcharodontosaurus and is shorter than T-Rex, while in real life, they would be around the same height. The about this game is, is that the only true thing about this is Electrosaurus is not a tank, while every the inaccuracy is every single other Tyrannosaurus should be a tank. In the game, Tyrannosaurus Rex is way too skinny from its real-life counterpart. Here's a picture of its real-life counterpart versus this. Now, for the Mavosaurus, is a different case for it. In this game, it's very thick or wide for it to be a Maposaurus. Here's a real life picture of it. I know this is gonna really shock a lot of people about this fact. Not a lot of people know this actually. They, some people think the opposite. Quetzalcoatlus is actually smaller than has it go up to X. The inaccuracy here is that Megalosaurus in real life was actually pretty bulky. In this game, it's pretty thin. So in this game, the inaccuracy is that the Baryonyx is, uh, is, and snout is way too wide, and it's way too big for it. It's also way too big. It's like half the size of the Spinosaurus in this game, while in reality, it's not even close to half. Thanks for watching, fellas. I hope you enjoy for part two.